Welcome back to the Goku Report, and welcome back for the next unboxing slash review. As I said, there's going to be a series off and on I'm going to be doing on survival. You'll want to be a prepper or a survivalist, or you just want to look at stuff to be safe or go out camping or something. Last time I looked at a special, more hygiene related survival kit. This time we're looking at a small first aid kit. Now, uh, this you can actually find at places like Kroger. On average, these run about $9. And that's actually pretty decent. And I think one of the big things that makes this worth having is the fact this is actually a pretty good quality container. Now, one thing is it shows on the bottom here, it shows expiration of the end of November next year. So, total, that's for like certain chemical items and stuff. In this first aid kit, so you know it's good for at least close to a year and a half. That's not bad at all. But like I said, this is a pretty affordable small little first aid kit, or you could put this in your backpack or some, just in case, or in your car. You never know when it's good to be or safe than sorry, is the motto I live by. But first up, now a lot of this is going to be just more basic stuff. As you see, it says 86 pieces total. First up, you see here, uh, you have like first guide and numbers you can put for like ambulance or doctor, hospital, police department, basic stuff like that, which is actually good to have. And any notes you may want to put also on there. Plus this comes in like two different languages, English and Spanish. Next up, we look at, we have... Any bacterial wipes, basically for sanitizing a spot if you get cut or something to keep from like getting infected or some. In total, you get six packages of these and bacterial wipes. Of course, these are alcohol free if you don't feel safe or don't want the stingy feeling of that. Next up, we have regular traditional alcohol prep pads total you get in this 12 alcohol prep pads which is not bad so you get six of the regular plus that also it comes with one pair of latex gloves now of course if you're allergic to latex you can always get relatively cheaper in some kits they also include like uh other materials like there's latex some has like other materials so you can always find relatively easy this is just like the easiest and cheapest so but you only get one pair of gloves in this unfortunately that's one of the drawbacks also you get a small little thing of medical tape which is good for putting maybe like a thick piece of gauze if you're trying to stop like the bleeding of maybe a really bad cut or something but at least to get a small thing in medical tape that's actually a very positive thing to have then you have stuff like these you may be wondering what these are used for well this is used for a specific gel you get in which is for coating over like really bad like cuts really deep ones and stuff you would just put the gel on this and you would spread the gel with one of these. That's main purpose just so you don't get blood on yourself or something. And that way you can get it on relatively thoroughly. But yeah, total you actually get four of those. Also, you get a small package of instant cold compress, which is good to use if like you bruise or like somewhat badly like hit your elbow or something up against some really bad and it's hurting this is a good way to instantly help reduce the pain that's all so I think a relatively very positive thing as include now this is the basic gel you would use on like certain type of wounds and you would use this to spread this is the key I would say one of the key important items in this you won't find in your usually everyday normal like Johnson & Johnson for say kit or something. So this is good. Sadly, you only get one package of this. But if you want more, you can special like order things like this. 
but for a basic small first aid kit that you can get for like nine dollars that's actually a pretty good item to have in something like this also a set of 10 q-tips which is actually really good for multiple different uses as well also you get two packages of ointment which you would use to put basically over basic cuts and stuff to help reduce one the pain and to help keep it from getting infected you get a total like five of these small butterfly band-aids which are actually really good band-aids i've used bigger butterfly ones before and i think these are very good to have especially if you get like a so not a great like relatively small but still possibly a deep cut these are very useful to put on your fingers and like i said you told you get like five also then you have these like really small band-aids which you surprisingly get quite a few of these. Then you get these, like a bunch of your more standard size band-aids, which total you get 18 of these, which is pretty good, honestly, overall. I think that's a lot of band-aids. Also, you get four of these gauze pads which are really good to have for a deeper like possibly bleeding more since this can absorb obviously more blood it's good to have some of these gauze pads they can come in handy in definite situations you get four of those total and then if you have a much larger you get two of these giant gauze pads four by four so these are actually quite useful in total, so yeah, this in all is what you get on one of these. And right there, you can freeze, and that lets you know exactly how much of these items you get. So with that said, how do I rate this as just a small, regular first aid kit every day? I would say given you can get this for between 8 and $9.00. And given what you do get in it, I think the main thing that makes this worth getting, one, are the gauze pads. You at least have a decent amount of, like, standard band-aids. Then some of the butterfly, that's good. Some stuff like this, not a big deal, but thing like the Mankle tape, which you can use to help keep the gauze pads on, is good. Plus the fact you get at least a couple packages of ointment, some actual... Gloves is good. This is really good if it's a deeper gash or something. This for basic pain relief. And then getting at least six of the antibacterial as well as like 12 alcohol prep pads total. For the price of this, I would give this honestly a score of probably from 1 to 10. I would probably give this like a 9 out of 10 to a 10 out of 10. For what you get for the price, I think it's more than worth the money. But with that said, I'll see y'all next time. Same YouTube time, same YouTube channel, and stay safe out there.